And when it comes to keeping yourself cool, we can learn a lot by watching animals at Zoo Knoxville. Some love the heat, others have to get creative when it comes to cooling down. Shannon Smith went out to Zoo Knoxville today to learn from the experts. High in the sky or down below the water, animals are experts when it comes to adapting to the world around them. And that includes when it starts to get uh, really hot outside. Clearly, African animals do well in the heat. Um, and many of our native species as well. Um, reptiles, of course, thrive in the heat. Humans, not so much. So we went to Zoo Knoxville to learn from the animals. We learn from the animals to find a shady spot and take it easy during the heat of the day as well. We start our lessons with the otters. They like the otters swim, swim with abandon. Tina Rowland with Zoo Knoxville says the otters are, of course, popular friends at the zoo, plus their viewing area is shaded. A nice place to keep cool before you decide you need to jump in some water of your own and head to the splash pads. Go swimming, uh, you know, hit the splash pad, hit the watering hole. Uh, it's really, it's, there's so many different ways to experience the zoo. It's a great place to cool down. You can also walk under the misters through the park, many located right by the elephants. Our elephants love to cool off um, with, they get, like to get in the pools and swim. We do an elephant pool party. So we'll bring the water hoses out and, and hose them off. They love, they love the enrichment. The kids love to watch and the adults do too. Our guests actually get to participate sometimes by holding the hose and help spray the elephants down to cool them off. Getting some air and some speed can keep you cool. Fly like an eagle on the brand new Soaring Eagle yeah. Zipline experience. Perfect. Very good. Very fun. You can come off the side of our, our ravine about 30 miles an hour. It's certainly a way to, 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 to catch a breeze and, and cool off and have a really great time and a little adventure while you're here. Yeah, it's only scary because it felt like you were going to fall off on the very top. Of course I had to try it. Okay. Here we go. And I promise it's not as scary as it looks. <laughs> Head inside the ARC campus to hang out with Joe the Sloth, who teaches us that staying inside and out of the sun is a great way to beat the heat. And then maybe come back to the zoo at a time that's not so hot. Come early in the morning when everybody's, uh, it's a little cooler, the animals are a little more active, or come in the evenings. Every Thursday evening we do an after hours event uh, so you can enjoy the zoo at twilight when it's not as hot. So as we learn from our animal friends, take a dip, Find some shade, stay hydrated, and catch the wind. Reporting from Zoo Knoxville. That was fun. That was fun. I'm Shannon Smith. <laughs> Looks like it. What a great addition to Zoo Knoxville. It's the Soaring Eagle experience. It will cost extra on top of your zoo admission, but it all goes towards caring for the animals. We can learn a lot from the animals, Todd.